So you're thinking about moving to the Gulf Shores, Orange Beach area, and you're thinking to yourself, well, where can I get a good cheeseburger? Well, there's a lot of places to get a good cheeseburger. So many places that, you know, I, I wanted to do a top 10 list. Aileen said we need to narrow it down to top five simply because there's, there's just so many places to get a good cheeseburger. But we've managed to narrow it down to five places that are just phenomenal, phenomenal, phenomenal. So let's get to it. This is your first time to the channel. Um, just make sure that you hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and ring the little bell so you can be the first ones notified about the current market situation in the Orange Beach Gulf Shores area and all the surrounding areas too. Uh, we do, this is, I'm Mandy Hollis, this is Aileen Fountain, my partner, and we do videos just like this every week, so we'll give you all the information you need to know about, you know, moving to the area, living in the area, um, any, even vacationing in the area. Um, we're with EXP Realty, and like I said, we do, we do these videos every week just to be informative, just to let people know, you know, all the stuff there is to know, all the ins and outs, the good and the What it's like bad. to really live here. Absolutely. Uh, we love it. I mean, we get calls and emails and texts and everything from people just like you every single day. And we absolutely love it. I mean, we just love it. So don't be afraid to pick up the phone and call us. If it's nine days or 90 days before you're thinking about making your move, please give us a call, shoot us a text, shoot us an email, schedule a Zoom call so you can talk to us face to face. We'd love to talk to you and help you make a smooth move to our little slice of paradise. So today we're talking about the Top five cheeseburgers of, of places to get a cheeseburger on the island. And I think we disagree on just about every one. I think pretty close. We do. I mean, so um, I'm going to start with my number five. My number five on the list is uh, actually Tiki Bar. Tiki Bar has, in my opinion, you know, a great meat to bun ratio. <laughs> <laughs> and, it, and it has, uh, I mean, just a great flavor to it. I mean, plus, you know, as I mentioned before in one of the, our other videos, you can get a great bushwhacker there. So a bushwhacker and a cheeseburger just go hand in hand. I mean, come on. Um, so what do you think? What's number five? Well, Tiki Bar is a good burger, and uh, it did not make my top five, but it would be just outside my top five. I do agree with you. It is, it's a good burger and an excellent bushwhacker. Uh, atmosphere is great, so you can't go wrong with a Tiki Burger. Uh, my number five, and it just squeaked in at number five, is the Keg Burger. Uh right <laughs> oh my goodness <laughs> uh the keg as you can tell aileen doesn't need as many cheeseburgers as i do but go ahead <laughs> <laughs> well i have been having keg cheeseburgers for about 20 years <laughs> yeah and they've never changed they're always the same which is a good thing you, which is fantastic <laughs> uh it it's best and and I hate to say this but the keg burger is best when you've had a lot to drink <laughs> i gotcha okay well <laughs> Uh, so my number four on my list is actually not on the island. It's actually in uh, Perdido Key. It's uh, down in a, rarity point, in a rarity point. It's Hub Stacy. Hub Stacy has a phenomenal cheeseburger. And you can easily get there by boat if yes. you're coming from Orange Beach. And, yes. you know, all the locals know how to get to Hub Stacy's is a great spot. And really, it's only about a 15-minute ride down the road. It's That's really right. not, you know, if no, you're, if you're staying in Orange Beach, it's not that far to go if you wanted to go get, no. uh, get a good uh, cheeseburger hub stacy um do we agree on number four no <laughs> who's your number four uh my number four is the cove okay. which is a, a little local spot in gulf shores um i know the owner and it's a great little place for a burger well the, i'm gonna tell you the the onion rings there are oh my god they're phenomenal fantastic but i, I agree cove's got a good cheeseburger it just didn't make my top five um so my number three on my list is the Gulf. What's your number three? So I'm going to throw everybody for a loop on my number three, okay? <laughs> <laughs> and and I'm going to have to explain my number three a little bit. So my number three is actually Sea and Suds, which is a fried seafood place in on the beach. Now, if we were talking mullet, I, in Gulf Shores, I, I get it. Right, but but I'm, let me explain myself. <laughs> so there's two reasons why this burger, this cheeseburger, makes my number three on the list. Number one, it is a good cheeseburger, but it the cheeseburger, last time I had it, was $2.75. Okay. 
And now you do pay extra for the fries, but the fries are the really yeah, awesome. Yeah, but now you got my attention. $2.75. Okay, Come on. that's what I'm telling you. So wow. then the crinkly, they have the crinkly fries, and yeah. they're fried to perfection. So when you take the price of the burger with the amazing fries, yeah. and it is a good cheeseburger, to me, I don't know. Like that's It makes my number three list for that. Well, it, you know, my again, my number three was the golf. But you just about got to take a loan out of the golf to get, <laughs> to get a, a cheeseburger. Uh, okay, and then number two on my list is um, the old tried and true. Or Bama. I mean, we're back here again. Best bushwhacker on the island. And to me, their cheeseburger is phenomenal. Just be simply because mm. the main thing that makes up the Floribama cheeseburger is the bun. Because, you know, they have that Hawaiian roll yep. bun. And it's just, oof, it, to me, it's just fantastic. So what's number two on yours? Uh, number two for me is actually Cosmos. And most people aren't going to order a burger when they go to Cosmos. But if you do, it is legitimately good. Uh, talking about the bun, I think the bun really makes the the burger at Cosmos. Yeah. But it is, it, to me, the, the, it's a great burger. I absolutely love it. I've never had a burger at Cosmos either. so Most people probably haven't. Again, something else to try. And then number one on my list was actually number five on Aileen's list. <laughs> And it's the keg. I mean, the keg burger is just, you know, Overrated. Listen, not to me. The keg is just phenomenal. It, it, it's the same every time you get it. I mean, it's it's never failed. They don't burn it. They don't overcook it. They don't undercook it. It's just always perfect. And believe it or not, I'm not always going there inebriated when I'm getting it. My wife and I, my wife doesn't drink. So, you know, we'll, a lot of times we'll order there and go pick it up. So what's your number one? So my number one is definitely the Floribama Yacht Club. Uh, Floribama Yacht Club is on Old River. The burger is fantastic. The burger across the street at the Floribama is also good, but Floribama Yacht Club gets my number one. Yeah, well, you know, and it's funny that they are a little different. I mean, it, you know. It's a, it's a little bit different, but yeah. And I think they do that on purpose. You know, uh, the people at Floribama, you know, they, they have their little Floribama land, which is, you know, that they have the, you've got the Floribama, you've got the Yacht Club, then you've got Old River, and they've got the, the I mean, you never have to leave once you get over there because no. you got everything there. That's right. You can rent a boat there. You can rent a jet ski there. You can, I you mean. You can listen to live music. Oh, my God. At either Yacht Club or the Floribama. You can get excellent food at either place, even Floribama's bar food is really good well we're going to do another video on that later on about just we strictly can do about so the many videos just uh, yep. well i think that'll about do it for this video um i mean thanks for all the great information um guys again if you like this video hit the little like button hit the subscribe button and ring the little bell for notifications so you'll be the first to learn about you know everything there is to know about living in orange beach moving to orange beach gulf shores area and vacationing here. I mean, everything you need to know, we'll do the, those videos. Um, and if you see something again, like in this video, if we didn't mention a place that you absolutely love the cheeseburger, put it in the comments, let us know. We'd love to go try them. Yep, um, and then also, if you have an idea for a video you want us to do, some information you want to find out, then ask the locals, ask us. We'll be glad to uh, try to put those videos out there. Until then, see you around town.